no matter what happens, every day, all these little guys got to get fed twice a day, every day, no matter what, by someone. So before we do anything else, got to make sure they're all looked at, fed, and dry. Signs of a happy calf or a fed calf and a dry calf and a healthy calf. Probably making you guys dizzy because I'm in a bit of a hurry. But first, we got to finish feeding these little hungry buggers. You're gross. Welcome back, guys. Finishing up chores here. And then, we're going to go pick something up. Something that I have been in the works with for about the last month. So stay tuned to see what that is. cab is also fairly clean besides missing the Freightliner emblem which I'll probably get a replacement one of those just because that'll bug me for eternity the CB mounts are missing so there's the CB I don't even have a microphone but uh she's there everything works the only thing that doesn't work on this truck that I've found is the left turn signal does not work so we'll have to get that fixed i'm missing a little knob here on this window turner but really cool 98 has power windows on the other side so it's light out now here she is pretty good shape for a 98 i'm running into the silo so i can't get any farther away but uh just doing a little walk around really for a 98 with a body this body and frame has 700,000 miles on it so the truck is a 1998 Freightliner FL, FLD 120 heavy spec it's got the heaviest weighted heaviest weight rated uh, rear axles that you could get from factory. Um, it's powered by a N14 Select Plus Cummins engine set for 525 horsepower. It's got a wet kit so I can haul things with hydraulics like dump trailers and live bottom trailers. And the goal is I'm going to pull, the tentative goal is it might change, I'm going to pull uh, 40 foot silage or forage trailers with it during harvest and then out of harvest I'm going to haul uh, manure tankers with a hydraulic pump on it to unload and haul manure into pits. So trucks, trucks pretty much just going to be strictly farm use um, at the time. So we'll see how that journey goes. That's the tentative plan for now but you know things always change got a 98 Cummins N14 Select Plus engine in it. They even polished this intake tube, which I find funny, but uh, set for about 525 horsepower. Block only has 80,000 miles on it. So it's a reman done by a Cummins dealer. So got a lot of trust in that, but uh, yeah, body has 700,000. So pretty good truck's pretty good shape for 25 years old and all that garbage
So the truck looks pretty good before they sold it to me. They ripped all the tanks, the steps, basically off as much as they could, repainted the frame, polished all the aluminum. So looks really good for a 23, 20, no, sorry, 25 year old truck, 26 year old truck. So this truck's pretty much gonna be strictly ag. It's gonna haul manure, commodities, feed, grains, stuff like that. Just all agriculture things, so. Probably some trucking videos coming up soon. Pretty excited, fall's gonna be busy, so we'll see what that happens with the videos, but if you enjoyed the video, guys, please like and subscribe. I appreciate it, thank you, bye.